Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Mr. Envelope Plays Minecraft. I'm Mr. Envelope, and we are in the base today, and check out how everything looks when it's on Moody. I think it looks pretty cool. I think it looks pretty cool. I mean, uh, we're not going to play in Moody. Um, I think it's too dark, um, but I was just playing around with my settings, um, and I thought it looked pretty cool, and look how bright it is now. Moody is such a difference compared to bright. Um, yeah, I thought the base looked pretty cool like that, but anyways, uh, you just saw in my inventory I have some things. Uh, we are gonna go, we're gonna spend the episode doing some chores. Um, it came to my attention last episode that I do a lot of stuff off camera. Um, I do a lot of, like, the busy work, uh, during streams. I do it when I'm just chilling. Um, I thought it'd be pretty cool to spend an episode doing, um, all that stuff. Let's see, water breathing, water breathing. Cool. Alright, um, spend an episode doing some of that busy work, uh, on camera. What's in here? Water breathing. I'll just bring, I'll just bring them all. Um, I'll go ahead and close that. Um, so yeah, today we're going to spend the day doing uh, a lot of the things that I normally do off camera, which are, um, the ocean monument, um, AFKing at the witch farm. We won't do that on camera. Um, <laughs> um, and what else? What else? Building stuff in the, the towns that are all around and everything. Um, just some of the stuff like that. So, um, yeah, let's go head over to the to the ocean monument it's gonna probably take a minute or two so um i I, brought, I have some things to talk to you guys about a little bit um oh man i don't i get that frame lag every time i go in and out of the nether um all right let's check on the animals okay we got our little baby mule right there looking cute and i'm breaking way too many blocks um but we're taking the horse come on horse zerp, zerp, zerp. Zer, zer, bang bang there we go yes i really like this horse this horse is making me rethink horses in minecraft I like him a lot um but okay some of the things that i wanted to talk to you guys about um so i left the minecraft uh smp um i'm not uh, a part of that group anymore um i just didn't feel like they were you know the group for me and um, I don't really want to go into too much detail about it. Um, we left on good terms. I'm still cool with everybody there. Um, and everyone's been really nice to me and everything. And um, I'm very uh, appreciative about that. Um, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I am not in that uh, group anymore. Um, and because of that, um, you know, the, the only series that are going on on the channel right now. Oh, that's a lot of pigmen. Um, our, this series, our Vanilla World, which I love dearly, <laughs> and, um, Terra Firmacraft, which has been tons of fun. I've been getting a lot of positive feedback on that, so thank you guys for that. If you haven't checked it out, you should go check it out. I'll put links to that, um, at the end of the video, and I'll probably put one in the middle on a, one of those cards that pops up. Um, but yeah, there's only three series going on, and, I mean, two series going on, and, uh, I kind of want to change that, um... So recently, uh, Breezy started a um, Half-Life series, and that has been making me want to play. Whoop! There we go. You stay there, horse. I need to name that horse. Um, that's been making me want to play uh, Portal, and I kind of already played Portal One and Two, um, kind of on the channel, and kind of not. Uh, Portal One, I did that with my buddy Audacious Green. Um, yeah, we, we both played that. Let's see, is the sun going up or is it going down? It's rising. Because it's getting brighter. <laughs> um, yeah, we did Portal 1 together. Um, and I don't know, uh, that we like, we did, we altered it, alternated it. Like I did an episode on my channel. He did the next episode on his um, so Portal 1 is done, and then when it came to Portal 2, uh, we, we both played it on his channel. Um, but I'm thinking that, you know, Portal Portal 2 is like a one-player game, um, and I haven't played it in probably about a year, which for some people probably is, you know, not that big a deal or anything, but oh, that was weird. Man, boats are so broken. Um, <laughs> so I'm thinking about maybe playing it in um on my channel just like a single playthrough you know i mean it is a single player game um and water breathing um so yeah and then breezy playing um half-life has been really making me want to play portal because i'm pretty sure 
those games are like connected somehow like in their universe um, I've never played uh, Half-Life or anything but um, I'm watching Breezy here and you guys should definitely go check it out um, it's pretty funny because she's never played it before either so she's pretty much as lost as I am and um, yeah, I'll put a link to that oh no I'll put a link to that somewhere um, but yeah I really want to play like Portal 2 now so that might be coming to the channel um, let me know what you guys think about that because I mean I'm really down for it but if nobody really wants to see that um, I probably won't do it I might do it on my free time um, oh no 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 so we're here at the ocean monument and this is what I've been doing um, I did some of it on stream oh god but it's so much work I normally when I when I did this the first time on the scrub hub uh, what I did was I made like ooh this is I like how this is working um, no I did the whole ring around just the top layer all the way around the whole uh, monument and then I dropped sand I would like um, I had like this part I guess two blocks higher or something um, and I would just right click sand on it the whole time and then watch it fall. Um, I thought that was more difficult than doing this, but as I'm doing this, I'm finding that this is pretty awful. Um, it's taking forever to put down all the glass. I keep getting like stuck in little dips like that. And then I run out of glass really quickly. Like so far, I think I've used uh, maybe like five stacks of glass, which mm, I guess isn't that bad. But considering that I have to smelt it all and everything... Um, it actually takes a while, and then I still have to go collect way more sand. I grabbed, like, maybe three double chests full worth of sand, and it's all smelted already. I have to go get more, and, um, yeah, this project is just really kicking my butt, and, um, I thought it'd be cool to show you guys, uh, this part of the process, too, because this way you guys can know that I'm working on it. Um, it's taking a really long time, um, and this way I don't feel like I'm just doing this all off camera too this is a pretty big project it's definitely not necessary um like if i wanted some ocean monument blocks i could probably just go inside and start killing a bunch of the guardians but i like the idea of farms farms are fun um and they give me something to do um and as much as i'll complain about it i'm, I'm having a good time don't worry about it i'm having a really good time and oh my god we got oh wow that whole side's like almost done oh never mind there's there's a bunch of stuff over there. <laughs> um, so this episode is going to be uh, chopped up a bit. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this up. Um, and then we'll go on and work on the next uh, task that I normally do off camera with you guys. Um, so I'll see you guys um, in about three and a half stacks of blue stained glass work later. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in a sec. Alright guys, next up you can see in the inventory I have... I have... Um, ooh. Oh, that's mob. Um, I have some... Oh, I don't need those anymore. I could probably drop those off right here. Uh, I have some slimes. I got some fences. I got some leads and some carrots. Uh, what I gotta do now is I gotta go grab some pigs uh, that I know that have been, like, uh, lurking around the, um... The... Oh, hello, creeper. Hi, creeper. Um, hanging around the mining area. And, uh, honestly, I have not done too much work over here. Um, I've used the strip mine... Uh, quite a bit actually I needed some cobblestone so I just went strip mining and uh, we got a lot of resources from that so that was pretty good um, but otherwise I haven't done much over here um, I started that house way back over there uh, in a stream but I didn't do anything after that and I, I barely finished it like yesterday and I think it looks pretty good this house is actually pretty big compared to this house like that house is so compact and tiny I'm thinking this is gonna be the only big house like this um, and I still want to add a little bit more detail around here. I feel like it's too clean and pretty. Um, ooh, let me out. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's that's that area. Um, but I need to grab some pigs that I thought were around here, but I guess not. I feel like they're pretty far away. Um, and also, I wanted to bring back up uh, the whole Minecraft thing. Um, it sounded kind of negative what I said in the last clip because I watched it back. Um, I'm not going to like... I'm not cutting all those guys out or anything. And... Um, I might, um, I don't want to say like go back to the server, but I'm doing like, I might be doing some stuff with them, uh, in the future, like modded stuff. So, 
Um, if you liked me hanging out on there with those people, um, they'll be coming back, maybe, uh, assuming things go well with their end. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say that because um, it did sound like I was just like, okay, bye. <laughs> Um, but anyways, where are these pigs? I could swear there were pigs around here. Maybe they were over by the actual, like, um, the business area. And also, oh, there's a pig. Okay, then I'm not going crazy. I don't think I've killed any around here. Because I only see this one. Okay, there's two. Um, alright, uh, come on. Come on. Uh, okay, I only see two pigs. Alright, we got two pigs. Two pigs are better than no pigs. Come on, pigs. Love me. Come with me. <laughs> um, yeah, I want to get like some farmy stuff going over here. Not too much farming stuff. Uh, because I, I, I want to do a, a farming town as well. Um, I got pretty inspired by uh, Ninja Giraffe's uh, world. Um... He has, like, this giant wheat field and everything, and I know a lot of people have that. Uh, but I want to find, like, a big plains area that has, like, openness and everything. And I want to build, like, a farming area there that's just full of wheat and, like, really small, like, farmy-looking houses. I guess those aren't farmy-looking. Um, but, you know, stuff like that. So I want to have some farmy stuff here, but not too much. Um, Alright, piggy, so you chill with me. Um, And then this isn't a permanent build. This is just to get the pigs over here and to start getting their numbers up. Um, this is just one of those things that I had to get done, and this is what we're doing today. We're just doing some chores. Um, go ahead, come on, guys. Nope, back inside. Back inside. Uh-oh. You're going to give me a hard time, aren't you? Come on. All right, now come back in. Woohoo! Oh my god, are you serious? Uh, zirp, zirp. Come on. Come on. Yay! You did it. All right, um, how do I unlead you? Perfect. You guys are awesome. All right, make a baby. <gasps> it worked. All right, cool. That's another thing done. Um, also, guys, uh, I've been AFKing a lot at the witch farm, uh, mostly because I am completely aware of the fact that it's going to be broken uh, once we switch over to 1.9 because of the way the whole uh, witch is falling through the shifting floor thing doesn't work anymore. Like they fixed that bug. Um, I know that the witch farm isn't going to work anymore, so I've been AFKing there a lot and trying to just get, you know, as much as I can from it. Um, I know we can get all those things that the witch farm produces uh, on our own without it, um, but until we make a new one, I wanted to, you know, just get my numbers up on those resources from that, um, because I really, really want to go into the snapshots. I know I said I wanted to wait for 1.9, um, but I think going into the snapshots would be pretty fun, and it would help us get uh, ready for uh, playing like that. Oh, look, there's a pig over here. Huh. Maybe... Yeah, I think I did get these areas mixed up. Um, I should have left these carrots over there, too. Anyways. Um, yeah, I think it'd be pretty helpful, too, to, like, get into the gameplay of 1.9, because it is kind of different. We're going to have dual wielding. Um... I can go there. <laughs> and I think it'd be pretty important to like practice at least a little with that. Um, and plus, I'm just like really excited. I want to go to the end and everything. We probably still won't go to the end until um, 1.9 actually comes out, just in case something changes. Um, I should probably put those there. Yeah, it makes sense. Um, but yeah, I just, I really want 1.9 to be a thing. Um, so I've been AFKing there. Getting my numbers up for stuff to check out the redstone. This is pretty much all from the witch. We got um, this chest back here full too. Um, we still need to work on an iron farm. Jeez. Um, we got all that. We got all of this sugar, which isn't that much. Um, <laughs> and then we got all these gunpowder. I've also been filling up all the stuff. So that's why those two are pretty much empty. Um, and where is our glowstone? Okay, so we don't have that much stuff. But I feel like we have enough. Um, I have tons of bottles, too. I should probably show that instead. Um, but yeah, I'm just completely ready for 1.9. I really want that to be a thing um, on this world. So I'm probably going to be switching to the snapshots either next episode or the episode after that. You guys should let me know what you think about that because 
Well, I don't know, I might be making a big mistake. I'll be backing up the world every now and then. I mean, between each episode, so in case something happens, uh, we can always come back. Um, but yeah, just wanted to give you guys a heads up. Uh, what we're going to go do now is work in the nether, because that is something that uh, I've also been doing off camera. So let me grab some resources and I'll meet you guys in the nether. Alrighty guys, so you've probably seen this in the background of a few episodes already. Um, what we have here is our nether tunnel and you know as much as I like this, I, I'm not completely sold on how it looks. Um, I like the road though, the road is super simple to the point, it knows what it's doing, um, and the road continues uh, perfectly how I like it all the way here. And I like this a lot, and um, this is actually inspired by um, a bridge that I saw on um, the Minecraft SMP. And so that's that's what I'm trying to do here. Um, I, there was an episode two where we worked on these support beams. Um, I'm thinking about taking out that whole uh, little mass of stuff right there of the nether rack. Um, I kind of want some of that gone, at least like this part I want gone. And um, you can see there, that's where I fell and died one time. I threw everything in an ender chest. Um, yeah, I haven't gotten it back yet. <laughs> Anyways, um. Yeah, so what we're going to do now is work on the bridge. I want to make more support beams uh, in the space that I clear out because, um, I don't know, I feel like there's it's missing one. Um, it looks kind of off without that extra one to support it right before it goes into like this giant landmass. Um, but yeah, this whole uh, top right here too, it's like kind of funky. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do this part. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Uh, let's put that temporary block right there real quick. I'm thinking this part might work. Um, if we do this, maybe? I think this could work. Uh, take this out. Um, see, I don't, I don't want it to be, uh, the, that right there in the middle. Um, cause we are gonna have to, you know, we're probably gonna have to put these down all the way through. And then we'll come by and like clean it up where we don't want the half slab bricks to be. Um, and then I want it to go straight right here because uh, I'd mentioned before that I want a path going that way to where I get my sand. And then a path going that way in case, I don't know, we decide to explore that way and we end up putting a tunnel there. Um, let's go ahead and get this going. Um, also, I don't know how to transition these uh, these pathways and everything. Like they, They're not looking right. Um, die. Get out of here. Go, go, go. I don't know what to do in this part. Um, this might be something that I do in a stream, though, because um, I get a lot of good feedback and like tips on what I should do. Um, and I want to try to use stones, because stones won't get blown up by ghasts if they uh, decide to attack over here. That's my biggest thing. Um, I know I have glowstone in here, which will get blown up if a ghast shoots a fireball. But, I don't know. <laughs> I guess I'm not that worried if that breaks. Um, because Couch Potato recommended, uh, way back, way, way back in the day, way back way, um, when he first started watching the streams, uh, he helped me with this and everything, uh, he had recommended I use, uh, quartz, and I am all for using quartz and everything, except it's pretty expensive, and, uh, it has a very low blast resistance, so that's, that's what I'm worried about, um, otherwise I think quartz would look great here. Let's go ahead and get that going. Uh, I really want to get this part done right here because uh, I get so scared that I'm going to fall and drop everything. Um, okay, it's right there. Uh, yeah, let's put these down every two. Pretty sure that's how the pattern goes. I could be wrong. Um, and plus, this might even change. Nope, no, no, no. I might, I might do something different here. Cause it's so, it's so plain. Like it's just, it's just half slab. I always use half slabs on everything. Um, but it, like, it, it gets the job done, you know? That's why I like it. Um, here, let's take these out. Uh, one, two, three. Then we need glowstone. I have a lot of glowstone blocks. I think that's what happened to a lot of my glowstone. Um, uh, when I showed you guys right now, it was like all gone. Except, uh, I actually turned a lot of it into blocks. That's what happened. Um, okay, okay, this looks... That doesn't look right. Yeah, this is wrong. One, two, three, four. Why does this not look right? Maybe I'm supposed to go... <gasps> Ooh, that scared me. <laughs> that scared me. Um, 
no, that doesn't seem right either. But then, one, two. If I do that. Oh, that's gone. Then it'll be one, two, three, four, five. Glowstone. Okay, yep, we gotta do that. Oh, man. I have a fire resist resistance potion, but that's still not making me feel any uh, better about all this. Uh, let's take that out. It's okay if these fall. I, all the all the netherrack that I clear out from places making tunnels, um, I always smelt it down to make nether brick stuff. Um, I know nether brick is like super easy to farm if you like take down a um, a fortress, but I feel like that's a waste of a pickaxe, you know, like your durability and everything. Um, but that'll be completely different in 1.9 once we get some mending going on. I'm really excited about that enchant. Um, that's another reason why I want to go ahead and move to. Um, 1.8 because I want to start exploring and looking for those books. I think, um, you know, just exploring and everything will be good practice for uh, 1.9, you know, because we'll still have to be out uh, surviving and everything with um, with our dual building and everything, you know, looking for that stuff. But um, yeah, I'm just, I really want 1.9 to be a thing already. And another thing, I'm going to go ahead and start talking about this because it's going to happen. I just don't know when or how. Um, I was talking to Katz, and uh, he said something you should do on your Let's Play world is have guests on your show, or yeah, on your show, um, and I don't know why I never thought of that before, like it is a really good idea, like I am totally down for that. What if I did like this? Because like, uh, you know, uh, I've, I've played some vanilla stuff with my buddy Andy, but, I mean, that's just Andy because he comes over sometimes and I want to record stuff with him. Um, but if I had, like, Breezy or Cats on here, I think that would be, like, the coolest thing ever because, um, you know, they're my buddies. I want to I wanna play more stuff with them and I can't really do that on the Minecraft SMP anymore. Um, so I'm really, I, I just thought that was a really cool idea. That's something to look forward for you guys. Um, yeah, I think we might make it like this because then it's three wide. Yeah, I'm down for this. This part looks good. Um, oh, hey, buddy. So, yeah, that's going to be a thing. And I, the only problem that I'm thinking of is I don't know what we're going to do together when I have people on here. Um, ooh, you are being sneaky. No! I actually have to start collecting the gas tears and everything because we're going to need them for... Um, making the ender stars end stars the, the stars to bring back the dragon yeah we need them for that um ooh, this is getting spooky um all right i'm looking at my clock right now uh looks like we are running out of time so i think that is going to be it for this episode thank you guys very much for watching i hope you liked it if you did be sure to hit the like button and uh, subscribe if you want to see more. I'm Mr. Envelope, and uh, I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me while I get some chores done. I will see you in the next one. Bye bye. Peace out. Over here, and I'm like, whoa, what is happening? Because that's what I always say, right? Um, and then we fall down. Ooh, we get pushed. Ooh, we get pushed again. Ooh, we get pushed again. All right. So that probably wasn't that um, interesting. Uh, you might have saw some. I think that's going to be the first thing. Uh, you can't make a pickaxe out of it.